So today we have a brand new Honda EU 2200i generator. In this generator, I'll be installing the Hutch Mountain Tri-Fuel Conversion Kit. This kit specific for the Honda 2200i generator. Hutch Mountain also makes a kit specific for the Honda EU 2000i generator, but the installation process is pretty much the same. So let's begin with what comes in the kit and the tools needed to do the simple installation. The Hutch Mountain Tri Fuel Conversion Kit comes with the demand regulator, the high pressure regulator, the adapter, which goes at the carburetor, also comes with gasket fittings, washers, and zip ties. The tools I'll be using for this installation will be the drill, the step bit, some adjustable wrenches, the screwdriver, and some tape. So the first step, is to draw and drill a nine and sixteen of an inch hole for the gas port to go in. Like you see here, the center of this hole needs to be three quarters of an inch out of this edge. And four and three quarters of an inch out of this edge. I use a digital caliper to measure the distance needed for the hole but you can use a measuring tape, a ruler, a string, whatever works for you. After drilling the hole, we will remove the air filter cover to get access to the carburetor. So we removed the air box, we installed the adapter, we routed the hose behind the pink tubes, and we went behind these fuel lines, added two washers, one underneath, one on top, to the fitting that sticks out and then we added the 90 degree fitting. For the adapter, we installed the provided new gaskets. Now, we will also use a zip tie to tie this hose to this side, on this side of the clamp of the fuel line. We installed the quick disconnect to the 90 degree fitting. We also added the provided spacer behind the air box. We will now proceed to put the air box back together and tie everything down. Next step is placing the front cover, but because this is a brand new generator, it has no engine oil in it. I will be topping it off before I move on to take the unit outside for testing. Also, don't forget to replace the engine switch sticker with the new sticker provided by Hodge Mountain to ensure you're using the correct fuel when operating your generator. Now let's connect the generator to a propane tank using the high pressure and demand regulator provided in the kit. Now that the installation is complete and everything is set up, let's start the generator and see how it runs. The generator is successfully running on propane. That's awesome. It's also running smooth at 60 hertz under load, which is great. In my opinion, this Hutch Mountain Trifle Conversion Kit is a must for your Honda generator. And like I mentioned at the beginning of the video, there is a kit specific for the EU 2000i generator, which is pretty similar to the 2200i Honda generator. But the big difference is that for the 2000i, you need to add a engine switch. So overall, one of the easiest installations you can do out there, if you can use a drill and screwdriver, this will be an easy install for you. As always, be safe, like and subscribe, and let me know down in the comments what are your opinions about this Hodge Mountain tri -fuel conversion kit. Hey, thank you for your support, and this was Tactical Power Pro.